Um, do you want to talk at all about medications? We've been hearing in the news different stuff around medications, and I, I'm just curious what your recommendations are for our kidney patients. Right. So there's a lot of uh, misinformation on the internet about medications that can be used to um, prevent COVID-19. Mm -hmm. Believe me, if there was a way that we could prevent COVID-19 infection in our population, the Centers for Disease Control would be recommending it. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, so there is no drug that you can take to prevent COVID-19 infection. The best mm -hmm. way is the social distancing and then routine hand washing and, and what we just talked about. So unfortunately, there's not a drug that can prevent it. Now, there are... Um, data that's being collected to determine how to treat COVID-19, but even then, we really don't have a good understanding of the best method for, for treating COVID-19. So anything you're reading on the internet that makes it sound like there's this magic cure, magic drug for treating COVID-19, it's, it's misinformation. Mm -hmm. um, I would you know, use the Centers for Disease Control as your main source of information for how to treat it, and do not change your medications. Mm -hmm. um, don't start taking any supplements. Don't start taking any medications for prevention of COVID-19. You know, make sure you talk with your physician before making any changes, but definitely I would avoid supplements, anything that's being touted on the internet. Um, you know, your kidney, of course, filters the blood. So anything mm -hmm. that could be potentially harmful um, to you, remember the highest concentration is going to be in your kidney because it filters all of the drug or supplements yeah. out. So you just don't want to cause any harm. So mm -hmm. I would recommend making no changes to your medications and do not take any supplements to prevent COVID-19 infection. 